Welcome back peeps to Mind Over Matter and I am here with a very quick video as promised. In my last two hauls I was able to talk about these amazing bucket seats that a parent or parents a family gifted to me and my classroom and I have them set up around my little luau table and it's my guided reading area and I will walk you through what I have um, on the shelf behind the guided reading area but I wanted to show you these bucket seats aren't they amazing they decorated them with owls my peeps look owls definitely a theme for next year if i am still in the classroom this is going to be my theme next year no doubt about it and so they were able to get these buckets donated by a local store and they were able to use a cricket machine and for those that don't know what a cricket machine is it's basically a machine that cuts out different shapes different uh, sticker things so that you can craft with them and it'll cut out paper it'll cut out vinyl and they actually use sticky vinyl to create the different designs on all of my buckets so I'm gonna get really close you've got a little yellow owl and the kids in the family uh, my student who is also in my classroom was they were able to just get down and color those vinyl stickers in and just really make it a neat activity and the whole family was involved and I am just in love with them the kids love to sit on them my principal even came in and observed me one day and he sat on them and he's like these are pretty sturdy so I was really excited about that and if we get closer this is actually a foam top and they actually put I can't even believe it they put a wooden piece underneath they tucked all that wonderful fabric in there and it's fleece fabric I had to spray it down because of course our uh, fire marshal came in and make sure that I have that uh, spray down and then can you hear that it's got wood and then they screwed it into the other piece of wood so this is not only sturdy and it's not only deep where I can keep a lot of storage their activities their books their papers for my guided reading activities but it also is so sturdy for the kids to sit on it doesn't topple over it keeps it just in place and I'm just in love with my bucket seats and these are a little taller than the ones that you normally see like say on Pinterest or in other classrooms on line these are taller and so because I have third graders these work perfectly for my back table so guys leave me a comment in the comment section what do you guys think and of course like subscribe and share and I wanted to show you what's on my back shelf as well so I've got four whiteboards back there underneath each one of those tubs and inside the tub we have cooperative learning mats uh, we've got a sock and a marker socks are used to erase down the whiteboards glue stick pencils markers you name it and that basically um, is the tub that goes back to each table in my classroom for a cooperative learning structure so I keep that all nice and neat and every person at their table has a role and one of the roles is to come back and get the supplies needed for that particular activity so that is what I wanted to share with you really quick again like subscribe share and thanks for watching my peeps until next time I'll see you later. Bye.